right, so here's a fighter that a lot of people have been talking about here during fight week, really just because of the nature of his skill set. I haven't seen much in terms of a glaring weakness on film. Your thoughts? It, it doesn't seem like there is one. You know, when you're watching the film and you're critiquing him, there's not much to critique. When you're trying to break down where the weaknesses are, there aren't many. The guy can wrestle, he can grapple, he's got tremendous cardio, great top control, insane durability. He's got it all. He's one of the best mixed martial artists we have seen come on the scene for a long time. But he's got to continue to prove it if he wants to stay where he is right now in the UFC. And perhaps his greatest asset, at least thus far, has been his instinctual nature in the octagon, right? Just knowing which skill to employ at the right time. And certainly he's got essentially every skill you would want in an MMA arsenal. expeditiously rise to mixed martial arts superstardom. But how about Alex Pereira? Crosses over into mixed martial arts from kickboxing and essentially takes the sport by storm. By storm, John. I mean, so fast to go from a guy that was what can be to the champion. But when you possess this level of skill, when your kickboxing is second to none, and then you train with Glover and you develop wrestling defense, you know that you have a chance. Pereira not only had a chance, he took it all the way to the title. And tonight, he looks to get another victory. He's seemingly a perfect mix of intensity and composure. He has heart, championship medal, Alex Pereira, the total package. We're certainly glad he's here in the UFC. Alex Pereira, he is ready to go. So are we for our main event. for this light heavyweight fight. All right, to get us started now, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the former UFC light heavyweight champion, John Bones Jones! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the former UFC middleweight champion, Herbert Dean's in the building. He's the third man in the octagon tonight. All right, we are back in the tri-state area tonight. Dave Ryan, Newark, New Jersey, inside the Prudential Center. The Devils are not here. The UFC athletes are here and hoping for some more UFC history inside these walls tonight, champ. From the 76ers to the Devils, you understand the fans in this area know sport. So you better be ready to give them a show tonight or they're going to boo you out of the building. Back to his feet.
Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at one minute, one second of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Alex Poetop Herrera! All right, so it goes into the books as a clean knockout. No T required for Alex Pereira. Just another highlight to add to the reel. Massive power displayed by Pajeda. When you play